Hey, what's going on viewers? Zesty Lime Studios here, and welcome back to another drinks review. Apologize if my throat sounds a bit off, or my voice. Hay fever's bad for me here, and it's affecting my nose or whatever, but there we go. So anyways, I was in B&M, literally yesterday. Walked in there and thought, ooh, that lens looks different, like I haven't reviewed it for, before. Read the top of it, and it said, fruit punch. So I thought, ooh, I haven't done that once. I didn't even realise Relenta said released a new flavour. So here we are, fruit punch. So it sounds nice. Hopefully it tastes nice. So, obviously got the picture of the crow on the front, which is regulation at this point for Relentless. These are half sugar, just for reference. Uh, 21 grams of sugar in total per can, which is, I said, the half sugar. So, which I don't agree, I either think full sugar or zero sugar. Now, there is a story on here, which I will read, and it says, The journey towards artistry and committing everything for your segment, sorry, for your moment, is an accolade in itself. Greatness or glory doesn't come by accident, it is earned. In foraging, in our humble opinion, the ultimate tasting energy drink. We set upon a quest not for perfection, but one of passion to produce a drink worthy of the name Relentless. It's refreshing, smooth finished and uncompromising flavour knows no boundaries. Be unwavering in your personal pursuit of greatness. Whatever that means, but anyways, yeah, we're going to get straight to it and see how it tastes. Here we go, no explosions, which is always good. The smell. Oh, there is a fruit smell there. It smells more like, I guess like a dark cherry kind of smell. Yeah, kind of like dark cherries. Yeah, definitely along the dark cherry line, something like that. Oh, nevertheless, guys, let's taste some. Yeah, straight away you can tell it's definitely along the darker fruit side of of the spectrum. There definitely is cherry in there. There definitely is cherry. I will give it that. But at the same time, it then does have that punch. Uh, that punch taste to it, where like you are drinking a fruit punch, hence the name of the drink. But I think the forefront, the forefront flavor is definitely cherry in the drink, which is not a bad thing or a good thing. But yeah, it's definitely on the darker cherry types as well, and then followed by just I said it, it darker. I guess I'm seeing necessarily the berry type fruits, but. It's along those lines, again, like that. Sweetness seems to be okay for half sugar. Overall, it's okay. I'm not jumping up and down about it, but I'm not throwing it out the window. So it's definitely an okay flavor. Not the best, not the worst. Yeah, yeah, drink it. Bit of fruit punch flavor, cherry flavor in there. Okay, that's about it. It's literally just okay. So there we go, guys. Um, I mean, definitely worth picking up. And not to mention, before I do finish the video, the fact, and I know it's in b and but regardless, the fact they can still price mark Relentless at a pound for a 500 mil can in 2024 and beyond, hopefully, is actually insane these days because you can easily pay up to 165 now for a can of Monster, which is just insane. Yet, Relentless is still doing cans for a pound which is just which is just incredible so you know take note monster one pound 65 a can if not higher i think they're even higher than that now i think almost 179 in some places price marked and you think that's just insane but anyway that's a video topic for a different day but it's okay just pick it up once give it a try and make your own opinion but there we go thanks for watching viewers and i'll see you all later